Diabetes, now a true American epidemic. 30 million people suffering from this disease in this country. But one pharmaceutical company making life easier for those with type 2 diabetes, Valeritas, developing the only wearable and disposable insulin de delivery device in the world. Joining me now is the company's CEO, John Timberlake, and patient, Joe Doherty. John, let's begin with uh, who this product is best targeted to in terms of treat the type of diabetes and the percentage of diabetics who have type 2. Great. So as you mentioned, Dagan, there are uh, 30 million people who have diabetes. There's 22 million diagnosed patients who have type 2 diabetes. Um, and it's really an epidemic. That costs the country about $240 billion a year in healthcare care costs. So we designed the Vigo for, the, for that patient who is needing to take insulin. There are 6 million type 2s in this country who are asked to inject insulin every day, and two million of them are asked to inject three, four, or five times every single day, well, and that's, uh, a, that's a real challenge. Joe, how long have you been wearing the... Four years. And how, how is it different, and how long have you had, this is so personal, but how long have you had type 2 diabetes, and like, d just tell us about the change okay, in about, using this. About 21 years I've had oh, diabetes. Wow. And I have a uh, consulting company that uh, specializes in management, leadership development, strategic planning, and performance assessment. So that work takes me across the country. In 2016, I did 146 hotel nights. And so uh, for me, Vigo is just a wonderful solution because instead of having to break off engagements with clients and inject insulin four times a day, I put this on in the morning and I'm good all day. And so for me, it's three things. Transportability, mm -hmm. ease of use, and uh, quality of care. Because it's an even distribution of insulin throughout the 24 per hour period and doesn't involve spikes and dips. Right. So one of the biggest challenges, as we, we were discussing before, is right. getting people to take the medication. Exactly. You can, have, you can have great medications, but if people don't take it, exactly. then, then all the benefits associated with the medications are gone. So from this perspective, you know, what, what have you seen in terms of utilization of the medication? It's a great example. That's really what you said everything right there, Mike, is that medicine only works if you take it. And what we basically have done is enable patient to take the insulin doctors prescribing. So with us, we have about 10 to 15,000 patients on the product now in the United States. Um, and what we see is that the patients are lowering their, their sugars, their gl blood glucose sugars dramatically. And they're using 20 to 40% less insulin every day. And that's dramatic. We have published data showing that we can save the healthcare system $100 to $200 per member per month. Does Medicare cover it? Medicare Part D covers it. Even though it's a device, because it is a single-use product, it's actually covered as a drug at the pharmacy. So which that, is which is that should help you sure. in terms of increase your utilization among patients in this country, right? Exactly, because 40% of all patients who use insulin are Medicare patients. Uh, just one last thing, Joe, but mm -hmm. it, because, again, a traditional um, di person with diabetes, they have to test their blood sugar mm -hmm. to know how much insulin to inject at any point. How does this solve that for you? Well, it doesn't. I, I test my blood sugar every morning and every night. Mm -hmm. But what it does is it avoids those interruptions during the day. I don't, again, as I said, have to break off client engagements mm -hmm. to inject insulin or test blood sugar or uh, do some other kind of treatment. So for me, it's the efficacy of care that really is the difference maker. Joe, good to see you. Joe Doherty and John Thank Cameron you. Lake. Take care, gentlemen. And you're ringing the closing bell. The, the closing bell, bell today at NASDAQ. The NASDAQ. Yes. Hey, Great. it could be NASDAQ 7000, so <laughs> look forward right. to that.